Oh, just, That's just, on the lighter side of it, but also the school administration, oh. why would they keep this quiet? Why would they give the girl, the 15-year-old ARVs, and the mother is not in the know? Oh. I tell you the sure. things that happen when you're a parent of girls specifically, you know, you can just have a heart attack every time you're called mm. that there's an issue. Mm. Uh, the long and short, though, is that uh, we need, like you said, to be able to have a certain checking mechanism for those who will live with our children. But more than that, then I think all the teachers need to have um, a moral background. The other thing, um, just the other day, two weeks ago, a certain teacher uh, in the UK uh, was, uh, um, was, uh, well, was, she was actually arraigned in court mm -hmm. for having abused her position because she's the one who's supposed to be. She's, you know, you abuse your position as the person who has authority over a minor. Mm -hmm. So this also should happen to this guy. He shouldn't walk scot free. It's, Absolutely. it's totally unfair. And, and, yeah, and I think as a result, we should even make stri put stringent measures, especially like uh, Eric says, mm -hmm. uh, in girls' schools, yes. mm -hmm. uh, where you have... Because, again, we can't have all female teachers, really. That's not practical. No. Uh, but there should be measures that uh, if they are male teachers, then... And it's not just male teachers. It's I wonder if it that. also it's happens also the same in, way the in, other in side. boys' schools. It, it could happen. I the thing is, we just need to... Men are happened. very weird species, though. It has they, they are, the but it can happen in boys. I mean, if you think about it, there was a survey I was reading the other day. Majority of boys uh, nowadays, their first sexual encounter is with the house help. I'm not saying that the teachers... But that are, has been since Jadi. That happens. Yes, and, and <laughs> that means the woman is the one who is... Abuser. No, maybe the guy is just a little Most tricky 16-year-old who always enough. looks at the maid like, so <laughs> So it's just, you know, it's, it's, I don't <laughs> think the maid goes around. No, there's no excuse. Uh, no, 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 there's excuse? no excuse. But I'm just excuse? thinking, I'm just thinking, these boys are not like lying. They're just going like, I'm terrified. No, no. No. They're sneaky. They're the ones. They're where, sneaky. Um, Actually. No, but if he's a minor, he's a minor. It, yeah, again, yeah. Okay, when it's a minor, it's a different story altogether. Then but the 16-year-old, you know, that, that, sort of. that discussion, by the way, Mike, it, 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 it has happened before. Today. And the one where these guys were having housekeepers helping them out, I think that's another story. However, in terms of looking at the boy child as well, it's important. Because then some teachers, even when they're male, they can also just abuse the boy child as well. Oh.